On tour in the Far East, exploring cultures is paramount and in Indonesia there is nothing more important than Ramadan. In the world's largest Muslim country, the month-long fast is of vital significance and the first meal as the sun sets is the biggest moment of the day. To celebrate the local custom and the latest collaboration between Arsenal and Save the Children, Arsene Wenger, Ivan Gazidis, Tuba Akpom and Chuk Taniki join some of the programme's youngsters to break fast. Ramadan is a holy month, of course, for Muslims and here in Indonesia is very important. And the most important time of the day, perhaps, is the breakfast. So having uh, the Arsenal team and the manager and the chief executive and the players was really special. The latest project between the club and Save the Children centres around teaching vulnerable youth vocational skills. And today, the chefs of the future were putting their talents on show. Well, it is, uh, in fact, to see practically what we speak about a lot. This uh, means our charity work and to come out here and see that really concretely something is happening uh, in the effort we put in uh, is great and what is the most uh, for me the most rewarding is the happiness of the people who get this educational help and uh, when you speak with them some dream to be cook and uh, they have an opportunity to do that we can help them to achieve that I think that's what basically it is about is to help people who want to do some achieve something in their life. It's a program that will help 4,000 uh, young uh, adults, 15 to 19, 20 years old, to in vocational training and to help them to get better jobs and link with links to the private companies in uh, in the area where they live. The, the young people in Bandung uh, that are taking the vocational training and we're here today representing the 4,000 that we will be training through the program are really, really excited to be here. Food prepared and the sun now set, it was time to enjoy the meal and celebrate what the project is able to achieve in Indonesia. While the banoffee pie went down a treat with the boss, it was a gift of four handmade batiks that really caught the eye of the manager and Ivan Gazidis. We look great in that. My shirt is uh, absolutely great, I will keep that forever. <laughs> A tradition dictated by religion, Ramadan brings people together and today it brought Arsenal closer to the young people that it strives to help. It's a big tradition at the club and, uh, and it has followed in fact a little bit what football has become. Before the social community help was only local, now it's worldwide because uh, the Premier League has become worldwide and uh, so you have as well a worldwide responsibility and that's what we try to achieve. 